More than 120 dead dolphins have washed ashore between Virginia and New Jersey in the past two months. They're mainly bottlenose dolphins, and they are different ages and sizes. There's a number of things that cause animals to strand. It could be biotoxins, it could be disease, it could be uh, human interactions with fishing gear. Maggie Mooney Seuss with the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration says the recent rash of dolphin deaths is very similar to an episode that happened in 1987 when more than 900 dolphins died. In that case, a bacterial infection was mostly to blame. Virginia has seen the biggest spike this summer. 42 dolphins died in July compared to 10 in July 2011 and 2012 combined. How concerned is NOAA that this is happening? The concern here is that it's an elevated number of uh, one species. So we are watching this very closely and collecting much information as we can. Sometimes the dolphins are found sick but alive. This one was found trapped on a sandbar in Long Island. But rescue worker Julika Woschel nursed it back to health. Uh, we still try to collect as much data and information as we can from them, so we're hoping that there's still going to be a positive from, from those deaths. Experts say the carcasses pose no potential health risk and the affected beaches are safe. One of the biggest issues has been cleanup. Each dolphin can weigh up to 500 pounds. Vanita Nair, CBS News, New York.